Hi, today I'm going to talk briefly about how to use the supplement list for Dr. Mullen. A, a link to access that list should be attached to this video. If not, you can find it on my website, nancymullenmd.com. Uh, hover over About, click the, on Useful Forms and Links in the drop-down menu, and there you'll see Supplement List for Dr. Mullen. The, um, the first part of page one tells you briefly how to use the supplement list. I use it to keep your treatment organized and to um, simplify the communi communication between the two of us about what you're taking and, um, and how to introduce it. If, if you run into a roadblock somewhere with a reaction to what you're taking, I can see very simply when you send me the supplement list, I can see very simply what it is that you have started and maybe why you're having the problem with it. The second half of page one of the supplement list gives me the opportunity to give you in writing what tests I want you to use. Page two of the supplement list, there's a first paragraph which describes how you should start communicating with Dr. Amy and then notes about diet. Diet is like really important. If you don't get diet right, nothing will go right. So, and then on the second half of page two, program to reduce in, uh, neurological inflammation. That is really important in itself and will be the subject of its own video coming up next. So I'm not going to go into it here. But it's more instructions, more general instructions, like everybody should remove sugar, processed food, junk food, and non-nutritive food. Everybody should remove allergic food, ha have no trans fats in your diet, and then I need a list of the prescription medications that you're taking. So this brings us to the top of page three. The top of page three starts to list the supplements that I have recommended. You don't take all the supplements on the list. You just take the ones that I have written instructions next to. Um, and, uh, and you'll see what those are when you get your list. So, uh, and I want to point out that on page three and like the first half of page four, those are supplements which enhance methylation. And they need to be added carefully, one at a time, in low doses, so that you don't push yourself into some kind of a reaction adding those supplements. And, and um, so you'll see uh, that I have very carefully delineated on the list what to do and that when I write instructions on the list, it'll be even more careful. The supplements listed below the two lines on page four are supplements that do not directly impact methylation. As such, they may be added more quickly than the supplements above the two lines. And, um, you can, you can jump ahead on those, but mostly I want you to get the supplements that are important for methylation in um, uh, because they are the ones that are going to make the critical difference for you. Um, so you can take a look at what supplements are on the bottom half of page four and leaving out to the rest of the list. Um, but that's it. It's, and you can see with one click, you can attach this list to an email and I will know exactly what you're doing. And that's what I need to know exactly what you're doing for me in order to know why something is a problem or what you need to do to clear it up. So that's it folks. That's the, this, uh, supplement list for Dr. Mullen. Don't leave home without it. And um, you can see there are separate sections for other uh, 
and separate sections and and basically that's all I want to say for now. So thank you very much for watching this video and um, we'll, we'll talk again. Take care. Bye-bye.